Good afternoon everybody, this is Nel Karoko again. Today one more question and I will continue with my projects now. Okay, so the, the question for this one is, um, is there a possibility that we can change the luminaire in a group or in a linear position like for example this one? Say for example, I want to change one luminaire in this group, is it possible to do that? And the, the answer is yes. Right now, I am using Dialux Evo 11, the trial version. And maybe you can use, uh, you can also do it in Dialux Evo 10.1. Um, yeah, but now it's possible. In the previous versions of Dialux Evo, it's not possible. But I think for this one, for the latest one, it, it is now possible. So for this example, this floodlights, I want to change it with something else. So just uh, grab this luminaire. Click on one fitting that you want to change and then select or replace selected luminaires or luminaire <laughs> and say for example I want to change it with uh, this one and then I will just press apply yes yeah, so now it is changed so I will just say no and if I want to go to the 3d now it is changed with something else okay so it's no longer a floodlight so it's still but it's still it is in the group but it is a different luminaire now okay so let's try one more in this room okay say for example I have a bedroom here and I want to change one fitting so this is a group of fittings and if I want to change this one for example with a gimbal or adjustable down light so I will just go and select it and then I will replace the selected luminaire and then I will replace it with some down lights with gimbals or adjustable option okay I think this one's perfect so I'll just select this one and then press apply now it's a different luminaire now but still it's in the group okay yes it's still in the group and say for example i want to aim this one into the wall say for example i have a painting on that wall so i just I can just go and aim it there because this one is an adjustable uh, down light but um the, the 3d is not showing that it is adjustable okay anyway so that's how you can do that and say for example you want to add one more luminaires and add it in the group you can also do that so for example i want to add something in the middle of this bedroom let's go and select for some chandelier here okay so for example i want to select this uh, floss a chandelier from floss so i'm just going to place it in the middle and i will just say select and center in this area okay so it's not centered <laughs> there you go and if I want to add this one into the group, so I'm just going, what I'm just going to do is I will select everything and then I will press this copy and arrange and I will press this group tab. So when I select one of them, it will be part of the group. Okay, so that's how you will do it. You can change one fitting or one luminaire in the group or you can add one more different luminaire into the group. Alright, so that's one of the tips and tricks. Actually, it's not possible in the older version of Dialoxigo, but now it's okay. Alright, so... Oh, okay, before I forget, I would like to thank Mr. Uh, Balish Shukimat for subscribing in my membership. So I got now a 0.91 US dollar as part of my membership. Alright, so Balish, I am not yet prepared. Uh, I did not prepare any videos yet for uh, uh, members of my YouTube channel but I will give you some exclusive videos uh, that is available or also from Udemy course so you will get it for you can watch it for free that is for now later on I will add more maybe some of my behind the scene videos I hope you will like it or maybe I can share to you some of my new books or the books that I am reading as part of lighting design. Alright, so if you want to become part of the members in my YouTube channel, please go and press this join and then you will be part of the member. I don't know how you will pay for this one. 
so just go and just check it okay all right so yeah see you again on the next video bye